morning everybody hope you're doing well it is nine almost nine a couple of minutes to nine <music> about to go downstairs get editing this vlog and then take the day as it comes i should be getting up shortly for work it's friday thank the lord it's friday where am i looking where am i looking i'm so glad it's friday i'm just looking at that keep calm and carry on it hasn't worked for me this week the old keeping calm um yeah so i'm gonna go down edit the vlog and then uh, i need to get something to eat i'm hungry because i really didn't eat last night <laughs> So I'm not sure now, uh, Jane, they're driving up this way, up, yes, up, Florida's down, up this way. I, know, I always get confused with those, I'm so stupid. They're coming up to help their daughter move, they're gonna move her out of her apartment tomorrow, then they should be here around noon tomorrow. Now the thing is, there's a horrific hurricane heading towards Florida. So they're trying to decide whether they're going to head home right away after moving Charles out or whether they're going to stay the night. I think it all depends on how fast this hurricane is moving. It's going to be a category four and it's supposed to hit Florida Monday or Tuesday. So they may want to get back and prepare. So it's a long drive though. So if they can have some sleep in between would be good. But you know, there are other daughters at home with the dog and I think it's their first big one since they've moved to Florida. So it, it's all up in the air at the moment to see what's going to happen. I was going to say to them, wait it out down here and then just go back. But now it's, you know, it's they've got their daughter at home as well. Hmm. It's a hard one. Hurricanes are terrible. Anyway, guys, must get a move on. I really don't want to move. Actually, what I really want to do, to be honest, is crawl back into bed and just try and sleep. I feel like lack of sleep is catching up with me today. Um, definitely with the looks. I put on two different <laughs> concealers and an eye brightener and it hasn't worked at all, has it? Ooh, the Gap's having a sale on. Ooh, everyone's going to be annoying us with sales this weekend because it's Labor Day. So we have a long weekend, which will be nice. Pete has Monday off. He's going to do a little bit of work on the deck tomorrow, That he, what he can do on his own, and then he and his brother are going to work on it on Sunday. And Pete reckons they might finish it to a point, so we'll see, hopefully. Just want some banisters on it, and then to be able to put a couple of chairs out there so we can at least sit outside before winter sets in. I'm hoping we have a decent fall. Last year we seemed to go from summer to winter, and around here and a little upstate New York, we get the most beautiful colors when the trees change. And last year, I feel like as soon as the trees started changing, we had some real windy, wet weather. So we didn't get to enjoy all the beautiful colors. And did we go? Yeah, we did go to Barton Orchards last year. Um, this, we've been going up the last couple of years where you do apple picking, they have a corn maze and everything. But at night they do, the corn maze lit up. Now I couldn't find my way through it during the day. I could never do it at night. I get, when it gets to things like that, I panic. Like those, um, I remember we used to go to the uh, amusement park and I went in the House of Mirrors once and I just get to a point where I'm like, I'm never gonna get out of here. Plus I hate mirrors anyway. I very rarely look in a mirror, except when I'm drying my hair and putting on this little bit of makeup. But um yeah, being in the House of Mirrors, it just freaked me out. I'm like, nope, not going in there again. I know, I'm a weird one. Anyway, let's get this day started, Jen. Her new uniform today. She finally got her shirt. Feel yes. more comfortable? Yes. It's very cute. And she just wears like dress Foot Locker. <laughs> Foot Locker. Please, what size would you like? <laughs> there she goes. Hey guys, so we've come up earlier than usual. It's quarter to two. I've been up here since about uh, one. I was sitting down, I was in Blood X's live, and then suddenly Roxy came and stood next to me, and then the next second, she got ill on me. My poor buddy. So I had to change, it was on my shorts, on my tank top, everything. And uh, so I decided to come up here. She's fine now, absolutely fine, but if it keeps up over the weekend, we're gonna take her to the vet. 
um, have her checked out. <laughs> can't can't go through anything else, guys. We really can't. Um, so I decided to get change to come up here, and then uh, Blood X did a raid into Mickey XOXO's channel, so I was in there with them. And I was just about to go down and make a cup of tea, and well, Ashley called me first to ask a favor, so I took care of Ash, and then Pete called me two minutes later, and he goes, I'm on my way home, and I'm like, why, what's the matter? Like, automatically thinking something's wrong, he doesn't feel good. He goes, we're on half day today. I said, you never told me. He goes, I did. I said, no. You told me you were off on Monday. He goes, oh no, we got a list of all the half days. So whenever there's a holiday weekend, excuse me, the company's new policy, just the last few months, because they did it July 4th as well, but he didn't get off this early. Uh, it was like two or three at that time, but they, oh, four. But anyway, they let them go at one, so he's on his way home, so that's great. So now Pete can have three and a half days and I'm, I would say a relaxation, but we all know Pete, don't we, by now, that Pete will not be relaxed, and he never does. But he, I think he's all up to date on all his pics for the kids' pictures, because he said something the other night, I have nothing to do. I'm like, go lay on the couch, here's the remote, watch the telly. So I think he did for a little while, and then he fell asleep. Last night he was talking to me after we got home, because he was telling me again about going to the doctor. I'm like, yes, 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 I will, I will, I will, let me get through this first. And two seconds later, he's like, he's talking to me, and he's like, I'm like, good night, Pete. He goes, no, no, I'm awake. And two seconds later, poor thing, he's working himself too much. Anyway, oh, I know he'll probably edit the pictures from the band night last night. I don't know if he did that when we got home, because when he went downstairs after, I don't know whether he went. No, he did. He went in the office to do something. Anyway, whatever he's done, he's done. We are supposedly having somebody stop by that wants to order senior portraits today. I did tell him just put it through the door. There was a couple of little marks on the carpet from Roxy from a few days ago when she wasn't very well. So I was on my hands and knees scrubbing those today. And I think now Pete's gonna run the um, carpet cleaner over at some point before tomorrow. Jane and that are on their way up here. I uh, still won't know till later on or even tomorrow if they're gonna stay here or if they're just gonna go right back home. So it's a waiting game. Ash is working till six and then she's home. She is so excited. She and her, two, her friends that she went with last year to see It have ordered their tickets for next week. It, is it It too? Oh, that's, oh God, so I just got the shivers. Even the thought of this turns my stomach. But she, um, she loves, Ashley, is, I, I don't know whose kid she is. She's into all these, she's not a kid, I know, but she's mine. I always have to say that because every now and again someone will go to me, Sue, she's not a kid. I know she's not, but she will always be mine. Just like I'm my mum's, Pete's mum's, you know what I mean? That's our prerogative, so leave me alone if that one person wants to pick on me again. Don't bother. Um, she loves these like horror movies, scary movies and all that, even though they frighten her to death. <laughs> But they're going to the 740 next week at this certain place. And I think you can order food at this place and drinks. I think it, it's definitely different. I forget where she said it was. And then later on after that, she's going out with her friends. She goes, that's good. I won't be coming home and going right to bed. Last time they saw it really late. And then she came home, went to bed because she had to work the next day. At least now. It opens on Friday. They couldn't get a good time on Friday so they're going on Saturday. So she's off on Sunday. So that will be good. And I've said so a hundred times. But yeah, so Pete's on, and I did it again. Pete's on his way home. I'm not one of those persons who say like, like, like. I'm a so, 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 or anyway. Oh, steady, steady. It's okay. Good girl. You're good. Um, yeah, he's on his way home. So that's good. I don't know if they had lunch first. Usually they even still do lunch for them first. The one nice thing about where Pete works, they lay on a breakfast and a lunch and they don't have to pay for it. That's unheard of. Because even when I worked at the corporate office um, that I've showed you guys before over by where Ash works, we had to buy ours. I will talk to you guys in a little while. I'm gonna drink my tea. Not a cloud in the sky tonight. Some earlier. Oh. You alright, Roxy? Just got to take something fresh, got a bit of headache. Um, I think we're just going to order a pizza for tonight. 
Pete's on the phone with somebody. The lady that was going to come by today hasn't come by, so maybe she's changed her mind. But uh, he's been busy anyway. But yeah, Ash is, was wearing a new uniform today. I showed you this morning, I think, and I just love it. Looks so cute, the trousers with the t-shirt. A lot better than the heavy polyester dress that, especially when it's hot and you're like, oh. And he's chatting away and she's coming down now, so I'm gonna enjoy my coffee. Come video from the bathroom window because Ash is in the shower. So he's not really doing anything spectacular tonight anyway. It's nice out. Everyone's home. One, two, three. from John's and a garlic nut, water, and I have to have a bit of soda to taste. It's 10 o'clock, um, I was watching live PD, as you do on a Friday. I tell you, I know they say criminals aren't very smart, but oh, I just laugh at some of them. There's this one kid took off in a van, running on rims, because the tires all popped. And then when he gets caught, he, he legs it when the car, he stops the van a truck, legs it, they catch him, tase him, and he's just like playing up to the cameras. Am I on live PD? Hi, live PD. Like, seriously, that was your goal to go out and get yourself on TV. Anyway, I'm going to love and leave you for this evening. I hope everyone had a brilliant, brilliant Friday. Whatever it is you did today, I hope it was a good one. And we will definitely see you tomorrow. Good night, guys. Mm -hmm.